Hello, Scrabble here, back with more The Messenger on Nintendo Switch. This time, I think we are in the future. We've definitely gone through a time change after completing the Tower of Time. What happened? I warped or something, and everything looks different now. Hello? Okay, that is a really cool hat. Seriously, wow! Any idea what happened, though? Sorry, I just couldn't get over the hat. Need anything? Uh, let's see here. No upgrades. Current area. Welcome to the Cloud Ruins. Oh, Cloud Ruins are where we are. Remnants of a civilization of giants that used to live in the sky. This place is beautiful, but the structures feel precarious. Yeah, bad place if you're afraid of heights. How high am I? You mean in my opinion? <laughs> what? Oh, geographically. Well, you entered the Tower of Time at the top of the mountain and then exited through the top of the tower. So, I'd say fairly high. Enjoy the sights. Ooh, look. What's the deal with everything looking so different? You know, I was wondering how you were going to deal with the implications of time travel. Seems ignorance really is bliss. Pardon? That moment in the Tower of Time? Yeah? It sent you to the future! Neat. Yes, precisely. Neat. <laughs> what do you care to chat about? Any stories? Of course, here's one for you. There was once a starving little boy who never missed a chance to help his fellow villagers. One day, after helping an old man carry a heavy bundle of weed, he was offered a loaf of bread. Eat your fill, my boy. Well deserved, he began. But if you feel like helping even more, there are two gnomes hiding in the forest who are even hungrier than you are. Now that boy was an empathetic one. His mind was made up instantly. After a short hike, he found the gnomes and split the bread between the two of them without even saving a bite for himself. Thank you, kind little boy, the gnomes beamed. It seems you have lifted our curse. Indeed, to punish them for their greed, a spirit had put them under a rather annoying spell. They were exiled to the forest, carrying a magic little mill capable of producing anything its bear desired. But the little mill's magic would only be activated once the gnomes were fed by a stranger acting out of selfless generosity. To starve while carrying a relic promising abundance. A cruel fate indeed. Now you can imagine the little boy's surprise when he was given the magic item. Name something you want. While turning the crank to the right, the little mill will produce an endless stream of it, the gnomes explained. Turn to the left, we'll stop. After creating a huge pile of food for the two gnomes, the young boy went back to his village to help the populace with his newfound powers. But as he grew in popularity, his older sister grew in jealousy. One night, she couldn't take it anymore and stole the little mill from her brother's bedside table, along with two leftover pies from that afternoon's feast. Adding insult to injury, she left on the family's fishing boat to reach new lands, hoping to have her turn in the role of the popular purveyor. Once out at sea, she decided to try one of the pies, which to her taste were lacking a little something. It was time to try that little mill's magic, she reckoned. Give me salt, she said, turning the crank to the right. And salt she got, heaps and heaps of it. Now, older sister had never bothered paying attention to how the mill could be stopped. Stop, little mill, stop, she shouted, first annoyed, then worried, and finally panicked. Salt soon overflowed the boat itself, sinking it under the weight. It's said that the sunken little mill is still operational to this day and is the reason why salt water is salt sea water is salty. The end. That was interesting, but it feels more like a kid's story explaining things about the world we know the actual reason for. Tough crowd, huh? Why don't you tell me a story and I'll judge it? So, you're looking for additional takeaways? How about this? Seeing how Big Sister's anger led to her demise, irritated people were henceforth referred to as salty. Ooh. Oh, I got another one. Seeing how Big Sister's shortcomings as a little mill operator led to her demise, unqualified people were henceforth referred to as not being worth their salt. Hey, this is fun. You should go. I'll keep on coming up with morals to do salt. Alright, I'm out. That story went on way longer than I was thinking it would. Okay, so we're headed down. Do one of these. Uh, I was going to go over, but it looks like up is the right way to go. Uh, those are spikes, right? Yes. And these seem to be like laser spikes. Giants! Well known for their laser spikes. What is... Ghost? I gotta fight ghosts now? Um, I could go over there. Whoa! Okay, 
Okay, that was pretty useless for me, but that's fine. Uh, I don't see what the advantage of being over there was. One of these places has to be an alternate path, and the other one has to be the correct path. I was hoping this one was the alternate path to the power seal, but now I'm thinking it was the right one. Especially since we got one of those. Woo! We're gonna fly down. Everything's good, man. It's all good, man. Now, the question is, do these come at us endlessly? I think the answer is no. Okay. A limited number of ghosts. That's good to know. Good info here. Okay, I'm moving pretty smooth, actually. I'm not terribly unhappy. Oh. Okay, we're gonna, like, do one of these. There we go. That was pretty good. I was alright with that. so good. Hey, happy guy here. That's gonna crush me if I go under it, I've learned. So we don't want to go under it. Really? This this easy. That's unusual. Now we're just gonna give you these. That's that's not like you, game. Uh, I don't trust that going down is not my death. So we're going to hop up to the top once again. And then we're going to glide. Whoa. Just trying to cling over, but just not quite working. Not the way I wanted it to. Uh, you need to have something for me. So, cool hat. Oh, you like that? Uh, is it why you chose to wear one as well? What? Well, you have the same hat. No, I got it first. Oh, is that what you're gonna tell yourself? Fine. I did have the hat first. You were all over it. Right. Yeah, that all happened. Sure. It's true, though. Look, you can put your head in the sand all you want in an attempt to preserve your ego, but clearly it's not going to work on the person that was there when it all happened. Need anything? Uh, I do, but you don't seem to have anything for me. Oh, I can walk on the clouds. And at some point, these clouds are going to disappear on me. Right now, we're going to dragon, eh? Alright, the question I had was, does this go on forever? Does this go on forever? Or is this a temporary thing as I kill this dragon? And it seems the answer is goes on forever. I mean, not forever. Temporary thing, but not killing the dragon. Escaping from the dragon. Oof. There we go. So far, so good. We're back on dry land. Sorry, dragon. Totally gonna kill that dragon. I'm kind of curious if I go in, I'm like, dude, there's a dragon. Like, I think that's what would happen. Okay. Man, I feel like I've gotten a little better. Like, this, uh, aside from that one dragon, this level has not seemed too bad for me. The Tower of Time. Okay, that... That wasn't great. Was there a save on the other side of the dragon? There was, okay. So the question is, if I go in and talk to you... Oh, he's not wearing the hat now. So I guess that was a temporary thing. I was going to say, my dude's gone. It's really weird. Come on. Yeah, yeah, take it. I don't care. Whoop. 
Okay, we're gonna do one of those. Now, I gotta keep in mind, like, just after I was talking about how good I was doing, right? It's like, man, I'm doing great. I forgot. I forgot. I forgot. I got to the exact same spot, and I forgot what had happened before. You're like, man. Just after I was talking about how I died there, <laughs> I died there once again. Didn't even stand a chance. Yeah, you can take that stuff. I don't care. You can go away, too, if you want. Fine. Whew. Uh, this looks tricky. Good. We got a heal. We got a uh, save. Once again, a thing that looks like I should be able to move over. But if I can, I don't know how yet. There we go. Give me one of these. And this. That could have been really dumb. That was probably really dumb. Because I could have used her to get an extra jump. Uh, wait, 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 wait. I know there's a thing right here. I want that thing. I didn't use it again. Ah! There we go. Alright, you had to stand on it while it fell. Ugh. Alright, level's getting better for me here. handle that well. I should have been on the uh, on the shurikens. There we go. If I hit both of them before I grab it, then it's pretty much useless to me. That's something I've learned. That was dumb. Here we gotta fall like so. Okay, I'm just gonna head down. Hmm. I'm pop up here, I think. Yeah, I was pretty positive that there was a Whoa! Better way to go. At least I'm collecting some stuff. Oh, not only was there a better way to go, I have to go that way. This way is the temporary reprieve. There we go. I should walk down. That was dumb. I really wish there was a checkpoint right up there. Alright, take them! Take them! You deserve it more than me. That's what you wanted to hear. Oh, I didn't wing. I didn't wing suit. I gotta hit the button to get a wing suit. Fifty-two times I've died. That doesn't seem too bad. One of those things where you're just slightly off on the controls. Started out strong. Now, I'm less strong. 
That's better. I actually was not super ashamed of that. Okay, there we go. All right, we're gonna just pop, pop. Whoa! There we go. Whoa, that was, that was close. There we go, I wasn't quite sure about that hop. I was feeling kind of tense. Okay, come on, buddy. Collect some things. Again, I got a couple, couple of things I'm looking for. There we go. Oh, I wasn't sure. Uh, you know what I haven't seen? I have not seen. Ooh, that was good. I haven't seen a checkpoint. You owe me a checkpoint, game. We've gotten through some hard things. Got anything else to say? Nope. Alright, we're good. I don't have enough to upgrade anything. That's fine. I really just wanted the checkpoint, because now we got dragon time, yeah? Whoa! That was bad. Womp womp. That was bad. Alright. This could take a couple of deaths. I like how Corbel is super afraid of the dragon, which makes sense, because the dragon is going to rock me in a single hit. Uh, I need to be higher. Needed to be higher. Too low. All right. Shutting up here while I do my job. Whoo! Take that dragon. Well, you got you want to talk to me with this dragon yet? Because I really kind of want to chat about this dragon. You don't, but I do. Be like, yo, dude, what is with the dragon? Get a very slow moving spike. Seems weird. We should have a faster moving spike. Ah! I lost the uh, things because I went too quick. Oh, that's right. I got piercing. Whoa! Whoo! Deadly. Okay. Easy enough. don't really want to go down there. Wait, for nothing? No thanks. I'll skip. It's trying to lead me this way. But I'm not 100% sure why. So let's check the other side too. Ah! Seal of Power. That's going to open up. I will take you, Seal of Power. Okay, we got to wait till that comes up. And then we're going to just... Jab onto there real quick. Whoop. All right, we're gonna jump over. That. Kind of feel like we actually know how to play the game. 
Look at that. First time seal of power. Wonderful. That feels nice. That that honestly does feel nice. That's not even a joke. That that's like vindication right there that I don't completely suck. Sometimes you feel like you suck. You know, sometimes it's like I must really, really suck something terrible. Don't think this is a fight yet. Oh, hey, there's a dude in front of me I'm gonna have to hit. I'm going too fast. I gotta slow down. I'm not seeing enough ahead of me. Going too fast is a new feeling here. Whoop. All right, boss time. What do you got for me? You got boss info? I think he does have boss info. And... Do I reduce Corbel's fine or do I take the path of resilience? I think I reduce the fine at this point. Level boss. Hey, I'm not sure what's up next, but the prophet wanted me to repeat a line for you at this point in the adventure. All right, let's hear it. Okay, I always wanted to try the voice. Check it out. <clears throat> and on this day, the messenger shall unwittingly make his lifesaver indebted to him. And that means I'm not sure, but if all it fails, attack the fireballs. That's uh, uh, fair, I think. Attack the fireball seems like a pretty uh, honest answer. Do I have to fight the dragon? That's got to be what I'm fighting, right? Sounds like it. Whew. Oh. Of course, we want to hit this dude in the head. I should have uh, should have done the wingsuit there. Ah! A little frustrating. All right, let's see if we can take this dragon. I think the dragon's probably a little tough. There is, I think, where I gotta get most of the hits in. Ah! Man, I'm not getting enough hits. Ow. That was a lot of hits. Uh, if only I could have kept smacking them. I'm willing to bet you can probably take this guy out pretty fast. Where's he going? Whoa! Oh, Nelly. Are you kidding me? Oh, that was luck right there. I think you're kidding me here, right? Ah! That is a little ridiculous. Wow. He took out everything and you have to jump all the way across? That is crazy. 
Ah, uh, all right, I can do this. I can do this. Oh, that was bad. That's okay because that has not been my problem so far. I have not died as a result of damage at this point. Although that wasn't great. That's not great either. Only getting three hits on isn't great. That time, that time he didn't take get rid of the whole level. Ah, uh, so if he's not clearing the whole level, I should be able to do this. I might just need to be really careful about where I'm standing. Like, probably don't want to stand on the end. I probably want to be in the middle as much as possible. Ah. Oh, Ooh, that was close. Yeah, that... If I'm standing just wrong, right, he's going to take out lots of clouds. We don't want him to take out lots of clouds. We want him to take out as few clouds as possible. And we probably want to be closer to the left-hand side of the screen, since that's the only side we've seen him on for throwing fireballs at us. Oh! I totally wasn't paying attention. That's better. Ah! Yeah, I know, you go below. Take this jerk. And when he flies down, we can't let him hit. He's going to take out clouds. Oh, man. Okay, we got this. All right. Don't let him touch that ground, Scrabble. Try and keep him away from the clouds as much as possible. So that is an attack he does. Maybe if I hit him with a shuriken there, right? If I get him with a shuriken as he comes across, maybe he cannot get rid of, like he'll get the hit, fly back up. Try it. Dragon's a little tough. I don't mind saying that the dragon's a little tough. Ah, don't jump into that. Not that much of a scrub. Maybe we are. I don't want to be that much of a scrub, though. Ah. I kind of wonder if I could just take out the whole dragon right there, you know? 
Hey, look at that. Ah! That hit, that seems a little tough. Ah, missed him. Well, crap. At least I could shuriken him there. Okay, so save my shurikens because they're good for that phase. Oh, that felt good. No, 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 no. I knew that it would now. What do we got? Oh, the dragon's blue. Is he a love dragon? Ah, oh, how sweet. I've been watching you for a long time, messenger. Yeah, I know you. Who are you, anyway? Ha! Huh. So the disguise did fool you. It's a shame you freed my slave pet, but no matter. I'm now certain I can defeat you. You! Bwahaha! <laughs> Surprised? Time to pay for what you did to my people. Bold words coming from such an unprepared adventurer. The underworld awaits you, messenger. At last! The scroll will be ours. Watch your step now. Jump! We didn't get the jump. Underworld! Man, what are you eating under there? Under where? Underworld! Okay, and thus the cloud ruins are finished. We are on to the underworld. If you've enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit that like button. If you would like to see more of the messenger or anything else I'm doing, I'm doing quite a bit. Just today I put up a uh, Mega Man 11 demo quick look at the uh, Blockman stage, then feel free to subscribe. And subscribing helps out the channel a lot. You can share the video, you can comment on the video. I love talking to commenters. Thanks again so much for watching. Take care. I'll see you next time.